Hi everybody, welcome back to my 100% walkthrough of Assassin's Creed Rogue. On this video we are going to be getting all of the collectibles on Or Du Nord. Okay, now these collectibles were tough. Well, at least some of them were anyway. So the first one we're going to do is go to the viewpoint. And I'll show you how to get to some of these collectibles because, as I say, some of these are really tough. So from the docking point where the ship was on the way, what you do is you uh, run, run up this pathway, run up towards the outpost that we did, cross this log, and then we're going to climb up the rocks when we can. Not quite there yet, but we're nearly there. Oh, I'm going to use this tree to get up there. And jump. And up again. Uh, where are we? Oh, that's right. Then jump down to this little bit here and climb up. Up this log, climb up again, and then you'll see the tree that you need to get the viewpoint from, which is, whoa, there. I tell you, my free running on this one was really rough, but there we go. So there's the viewpoint. Okay, now don't dive off because immediately after you're going to go to this chest here and that way, best way to get to that is actually not diving off but to run back along your um, run back along here yeah. and then oh, down here And this treasure chest is actually in a mi in the mine. Um, and I didn't do this right. First of all, I thought I had, but I hadn't. It's below us yeah. here. Couldn't find it. Later on, they get easier some of these, but for now, uh, this one's down below us. So let's just jump off. Turn around and you'll see the mine shaft. Now that's the mine shaft where you went and killed the captain. That is, and it's in there. And this one's fairly easy to find. You just run in there and find him around the corner. The next one, however, is a real tough one to find. So look carefully what we do. So we go to this chest here. Okay, and where I am here on the map, that's where you want to go to. There's a mine entrance right there on the map where I was. Now you want to run all the way down the mine. It's a long entrance, this one. So keep running. Run across this bridge and it will break. So climb back up. And down here into the water area. Okay, turn right and run along here. Uh, do we want to go up there? No, we don't. We want to jump across here. And then jump across to the rocks over here as well. Climb up. And then jump over to these rocks. And climb up again. Uh, I climbed up, but that was a mistake. I didn't mean to do that. Um, so we want to be down there, actually. And you want to jump to this in the middle of the road here in the water then you can jump to the tree branch in front of you and then you can run along here and that's where the chest is okay I hope that helped because that was a tough one to find it took me a while to find that okay next is an animus fragment that's outside so we're gonna go back to the viewpoint but again don't dive off jump down Ooh, don't jump right down 
Okay, keep up top, but yeah. running along this side. And then up here. And then run to the side. Keep running along these bits of wood here. And you can see the animus fragment in the distance up this ladder and onto this log here. Then we can jump up and then we can jump off and get the animus fragment. So that's that one done. Get out of the water as quick as you can because it's freezing and it will hurt you. Okay. The next one is a chest. It's down here. These are all in the restricted areas. You can see. Oh, it's an animus fragment, sorry. And it's between some trees. It's going to try and shoot me here if I'm not careful. So dive off and get that. It's all in a restricted area, remember, so be aware of that. Then we want a chest, which is over here, which is up and in a tent. That's not too hard to find, so we'll find that one there. From the tent, you want to go over to this animus fragment here, which is in some trees. Keep jumping, you can see it now. So it's in the tree area there you're gonna swing and jump up and get it there that's that one done and that's it we're done for inside the area now so now we're gonna head to this animus fragment over here um, so from again run down don't dive off and then run on from this area and again Actually, I believe you could have run, jumped off because I think it's right down the bottom. But run round, following it carefully. In the moment, you're going to see the animus fragment that you're going to need. It's a little bit further up here. So climb up these rocks. And then up this tree, and you'll find the animal fragment is there. Dive off to get it. Okay, next thing we're going to do is go and get a Templar map, which is just on the floor. It's easy to find. From now, they get a lot easier. So from there, we're going to go to the Viking Sword, which is over here. Again, easy to find. That'll do. And how. And then we're going to go to the renovation, which is over here. You should have played to your stuff for the renovation if you've been doing all of the stuff that we've been doing. So get the renovation done. That's done nicely. Then from here we're going to go and get a prosperity token, which is here. And it's just up one of these double tree things, you can't miss it, it's fairly easy to get to. Dive off, get the prosperity token, get out of the water as quick as possible. Uh, there's another prosperity token a little bit further down, but climb up these this tree branch. And then you're going to jump off of this rock here. Uh, you know, you're not going to climb up here first, sorry. And then you're going to jump off of this rock here. There's the prosperity token. And again, it's just a leap of faith off. And I think the, this is the last one now, which is a chest, which is over here. Now that's... And it's right by the bridge. Broken bridge or tracks or whatever it is. And that's where we're going to end this video. We've only got one thing to do now. It's the hunting challenge. So thanks very much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And until next time, it's bye for now.